Hey, what's up everybody? Long time no see, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's been a little while since the last time I made a video in here, that's for sure. Hey, what's up? Frank Slauson here for another great Frank Slauson Show video here on YouTube. And I'm here at the School of Mines. I'm doing a radio broadcast right now. Doing my morning show uh, that I do. I'm on the air actually now two times a week. Uh, voluntary, voluntarily, just, but, you know, it's nice, though, because, uh, it's kind of like the stuff I used to do back on the days of Pioneer Night for One, if you guys, you know, obviously, if you remember that, uh, if you, you can go back and see some classic YouTube videos of, of, of those days, but, uh, what's nice about here is the fact that they actually let me do my own thing, you know, they let me do what I want to do because they know that it's not going to harm anything or they know that it's, you know, they're not going to get fined or anything or, you know, they're not worried about it. You know, they just say, go ahead, do a radio show. You want to do what you want to do, go go ahead. You know, you, you know you, you know what you're doing. And, and I do. I mean, I have a lot of experience uh, being a part of, you know, with the experience and training that I got from the days of Pioneer 9 for 1, uh, that, help, that helped big time. Because if I wouldn't have had that, I definitely probably wouldn't be out here to over here at this station today. But it's just nice because it's different. It's rap, you know. It's not in Thief River. It's in Rapid City, South Dakota, which is, you know, about 700 miles away from Thief River Falls, and it's been kind of a nice little, you know, nice little uh, soiree, soiree over here. And it, it just, you know, all the CDs and stuff that they got in the background. Bit of a nice background anyway, huh? <laughs> it's like what my music collection and DVD collection used to look like, kind of. Except now now my collection's a little bit smaller. and Well, it's probably half the size, probably, now. Than what it used to be, but, eh, probably like, yeah, it's not, not nearly as big as it used to be, anyway. But anyway, uh, this is uh, just a general update vlog to kind of let you guys know that uh, as of right now, I am officially done, for now anyway, with uh, doing interviews. Unless somebody responds back to any request that I made, whether you know it be this month or last month or whatever, I'll you know then I will do another interview. But if nobody responds back, then the interview that you guys uh, will see. This coming weekend, uh, either Saturday or Sunday, the interview I did with the uh, Diary of a Whippy Kid founder and creator uh, of the book series and uh, the movie series, Mr. Jeff Kinney, will be my last interview probably for 2013. And the reason why I say that is just because I, I am kind of burnt out from doing interviews. Uh, not so much the fact of doing them, but just the fact that uh, you know, I've sent out a lot of requests. This year alone, I probably have sent out, let alone probably three to four hundred uh, different emails, you know, throughout the year, uh, trying to find good people to interview, and only a, a small percentage of those people ever responded back and said yes. You know, only, only 51 of those people responded back and said yes. The other people either said yes and never got back to me, after I, you know, tried to get them again, or were, you know, just never responded back, never, never took the time to just say, to, to at least tell me no. Some people did say no, but it's just, you know, I just don't, I don't know, I just, <laughs> I know that in my heart I need a break anyway, no matter what, and that's what I'm going to take. I don't know how long the break will be, we'll see, maybe in the beginning of the new year, maybe in January I'll, I'll bring it back for a little while. But I want to, for, for, for now anyway, I want to start making more original YouTube videos because I feel like I've kind of lacked on that a little bit or slacked on that a little, a little bit since I've been here because there's been great opportunities that I should have brought the camera with and I never did uh, since I've been here. Even with my family, even with fr you know, friends or work or, or going to the mall or whatever, they're showing you guys the sights, you know, the sights and the sounds of uh, Rapid City. And so I want to I want to start doing that again, more on a weekly basis. So, and you know, as much as the interviews have been great, and you know, it's brought me, you know, it's made me happy just because of the fact that I was that I've been able to do it, and, and be able to I was able to do something that I never thought. The whole purpose of why I brought it back in the first place 
Because I wasn't going to keep doing this in the first place. I was just, you know, eventually was just going to just figure, well, I was just going to end it, you know, just because I never thought it ever about to anything. But the reason why I brought it back in August of 2012, like I did, and continued until now, uh, is because I wanted to see if it could be done by just doing it at my house or doing it at my aunt, aunt uncle's house or, you know, rather than a big studio. And unfortunately, this studio doesn't have a recording, you know, the difference between this station and Pioneer 9 for one is that Pioneer 9 for one has everything they need, you know. They have a recording studio, they have uh, four, four or five different uh, radio stations going on at the same time. You know, with the HD stuff and the, and the regular station, now they got a polka station going on too now, and it's just, uh, yeah, it's just crazy. I mean, but they, I mean, it was a lot of work to get all that stuff, but, you know, and, and rightfully so that they they definitely earned it. But but now it's like you know they got you know they got everything they they need here at the School of Mines. It's a little different story, even though it's a bigger college and everything. It's not, it's not. Uh, financially, like, we're supposed to be on the air right now, like, actually in local radio instead of just on the internet, but for some reason there's been a delay because of the storm that happened a couple of weeks back, kind of knocked something out or, or whatever, I think you're, you know, the, 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 this engineer guy was telling me about that, that something happened, but anyway, <clears throat> so sooner or later we will be on the actual local radio, and then it'll be nice to actually probably get more listeners and stuff, but anyway, uh, so, but it's been good over here. It's just that this doesn't, place doesn't have a recording studio or anything like that. You know, it's kind of, kind of like right in the corner. You know, of of this big Cerbic Center and here at the School of Mines. And but it's a nice place, so it's definitely, like I said, you know, a chance to let me be myself. And uh, so, starting in November, not November first, but the first week, full week of November, then I'm gonna start making some new videos. Probably two or three videos a week. I'm thinking. Just because I just I want to do I just want to do this, you know. I, I feel like I'm 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 comfortable here now, and I'm not homesick anymore. You know, for a little while I was homesick, but I'm not homesick anymore. I'm I'm actually happy to, to be here. I do miss my nephews, and I do miss my family. You know, and I, I I love them and I miss them, but it's just it's just the fact that I I have I need to do this here because. You know, this is where my other family is, you know, that I that I need to spend time with and need to focus on and stuff and, and focus on some other things that opportunities that, you know, my hometown area could never give me, you know. So whether it's working at Safeway, whether it's working at Sonic, whether it's doing this, whether it's, there's a new job in sight, I mean, you know, it's just uh, this is where I belong for, for now. It's not where I'm going to be the rest of my life. It's just... I want to give it a, a chance, you know, and, uh, uh, you know, see what happens. But everything's been going pretty good so far. It's just, uh, you know, a few loopholes here and there, but, eh, you know, it's not that bad. I mean, it's nice because Rapid City reminds me of uh, a Grand Forks, more or less. You know, it's like, you know, once you are familiar with the area and you know where to get, you know, you know where to go to get things, or, you know, or where things are, or where certain places are, well, then it's not so, it's not so bad, then. It's actually quite nice after, after a while. So, anyway, <clears throat> I just figured I'd, I'd just let you guys know that, uh, that, uh, I, <clears throat> excuse me, that I'm, just what my goals are now, and I know I've said this before, that all of a sudden more interviews come up, but, I'm, I'm literally saying after doing 51 interviews this year or, and then 20 last year, I am definitely deserve to take a break, and I think you guys would agree. So I'm, de I'm going to do it. I'm going to focus more on the videos and uh, just have some fun. And just, uh, you know, I don't care about this, you know, subscribers or anything like that anymore or making money off YouTube. I just, I feel like, you know, I made it to Rapid City, and I can I can make something of myself over here if I you know since I'm here now, you know I have nothing really to complain about, you know now that I'm here, you know and finally doing what I wanted to do, doing what I've been wanting to do for for so long, just never knew that Rapid City was the the place that I was going to do it at. I thought it was going to be Grand Forks or something, but but this is good. This is this is definitely a good thing. This is a positive thing, and I, 
I get, I get to spend time with my other family and stuff, you know, and it's, you know, to me, life's never been better, you know. I mean, I miss my friends, and I miss, you know, my, my other family and stuff, my main family, but, uh, you know, sometimes in life, you got to make sacrifices, you know. This is like, it's like pretending I'm like on a military retreat or something, or like, like I'm just, like, away for a little while, you know, and, you know, until I'm ready to, to come back, you know, but... But no, this is definitely an experience that I'll never forget. And uh, no matter how it ends or or, or whatever, uh, it'll definitely be, it's definitely worth all my time to be here. So anyway, I'm Frankie Slauson. And thanks for tuning in for all the interviews and and this you know tagging along. It's been a hell of a ride, and and now it's time to do something different. Now it's time to go back to where it all began and start doing YouTube videos again, because I know there's some people that miss some of the videos that I've done, so. So I just want to share that with you. You guys have a good day, and we'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.